bring that a bit more. So my sauce is coming on together pretty well. Don't worry, just continue stirring it. That's the white sauce. It will come up nicely. For my for my tomato base, soya mean sauce. Go start with a bit of oil. So this is about one onion, one medium large onion. So I'm sauteing my onions and I can actually put down my soya mince. It's come up to a boil nicely. Put it down. My bechamel is also coming up nicely as well. Perfect. So we let the onion saute for a few more minutes, three to four minutes, for it to become car uh, caramelized and then the fla flavors and the fragrance of the onion starts coming out. That's about it. And as you can see, my white sauce is coming out perfectly. There are no clumps, there are no lumps inside the sauce. So that means that it was done perfectly where it started. And once it starts to thicken up a bit, you just reduce the heat to medium low, not too low. So I have one onion, finely chopped onion. So meanwhile, my, my onion is sauteing. I'm going to add in the garlic. So this is just one clove of garlic, but if you like garlic a bit more, you can add into your own preference. And we let that saute for a while. After that, I'm going to add two tablespoons of tomato paste. And you can just smell the fragrance and the flavors have already started to come out, which is amazing. The tomato paste gives the sauce that rich and smooth character. I brought two tablespoons of oil, put it into a pan and heated that up. Then I chopped one onion and two tablespoons of tomato sauce. And I'm going to use half a cup of water. Again, so you add it in stages. Reduce the heat. And meanwhile, my bechamel is, has come up to a nice, thick texture that I wanted it to be on. And soon, I'll be ready to take it off. And just here, I have freshly grated tomatoes. Just going to use two tablespoons of that. Just add it in for that.
See how rich my tomato bay sauce is becoming? Bring that up to a bowl. And I take my one cup of Gordon Goodness soya mints, I add it into the sauce. 